Uh, you are preparing uh, two games. How is go how is uh, the preparation now? Um, since yesterday, I have a very good feeling because uh, the training yesterday, you could see things are coming back in the mind. It's always the same situation in the national team. Players are out for a long time. Um, they are losing things we have already uh, done, but uh, okay, now it's our fourth camp. So, as more camps you make, as more things somehow stay, and as quicker you make the next step forward. So, uh, I am confident. Even our opponent teams are quite difficult. Have you some information about Libya and Nigeria? Um, <laughs> yes, Libya is uh, quite difficult because nobody really knows um, do they get players from abroad or not. Um, we, we have information about the last matches they did and also the, the squad of the last matches. And um, we are preparing us uh, through videos as every coach is doing. And uh, the situation with Nigeria is different. Uh, maybe you know we have another German coach now playing against each other. Um, uh, for that we know he, uh, this team is a strong team only because of uh, the world-class players they have. So uh, we are also preparing us for that, but at the moment the focus is on, uh, on Libya. Uh, you have 80% uh, of the squad in Rwanda, some of them you will meet them with uh, uh, to Tripoli. Uh, are you okay with that? Uh, I don't have 80%. Uh, I have uh, now the, the last days some of our international players are also have joined the team. Uh, but there are still a, a number of players that are joining us uh, on the way to Libya. So uh, we have one or two training sessions, uh, uh, but I hope the players who are now with us here doing the camp, um, they are uh, getting things in a way that uh, the others can fit in uh, more or less easily. Yes. Maybe we need to jump a little bit to the next game against Nigeria. The idea of playing at Amal Stadium, the first international game of the national team, what does it mean for you and the, the players right now? I think it's a, it's a great thing. Uh, if you look to the stadium, it's a beautiful stadium. Now we have a good training field uh, and uh, we are hoping that the stadium is packed and this, uh, the supporters uh, or the fans are supporting us. Uh, this is giving us a boost for sure and uh, we, are, we are very excited uh, about this match. And okay, as I said, we will have a very strong team against us. So uh, you never know how it will be, but for sure we will give our best. Mm -hmm. but Coach, if you look at your, in your squad, uh, we didn't see some players like uh, Mohajiri, like uh, um, uh, York, like Gwatuja Abdul. How is the problem with these players? Uh, how is it? Okay, I am um, normally more or less answering this question uh, every camp. So uh, this camp is as the camps before. It's uh, in one way it's for the matches that are coming up, but it's also for the perspective uh, of uh, Chan and Sikafa. Uh, and uh, now if I go to Muhachi, uh, I know Muhachi. Um, he is not changing. If I watch him, he is doing what he is always doing and I know him, I had him now in uh, two camps. Um, I also want to try other local pay players on these positions. We have Kevin, now I have invited another one. I don't put out Kevin, so I had to put out uh, Muhachi to also see the other guy uh, showing up in, uh, in the group. Uh, this doesn't mean that Muhachi is now out of, uh, of the team. Uh, it's, uh, it's someone who I really know and who is doing a good job when he, he is with us. But uh, I can't invite, uh, or if I invite somebody else, I have to take out somebody because the number will get too big. Uh, so it's nothing bad about uh, Muhachi to say. As I understand, he did that much with your philosophy of playing. <sighs> 
Yeah. I think we have talked in one of our meetings that Muhachi is a very special player uh, uh, who somehow needs uh, the team around him is doing or is covering topics he is not working on in 100%. Uh, so in that way, uh, that's why I said I know him and uh, if he would play, um, I would have to give other instructions to other players because they have to do uh, things a little bit different. Um, so that's, uh, it's, it's not bad, it's not good, but I just wanted to give another person also the chance to show up because um, sooner or later you have to build also for the future. Huh? What about others, Yolk and uh, Abdul and Christian? Okay, um, let's talk about Abdul. I, I was in contact with Abdul and I was explaining him the situation, also the situation with Isaac, for example. Huh? These are players, unfortunately, that have left the continent. Huh? So they are absolutely out for Sikafa and for uh, Chan uh, matches. Um, and, and therefore, now it is difficult um, putting them in because I think at the moment there is no reason to change our center defense. Huh? And if I don't change my center defense at the moment, then the second part are, are players that can play in Sikafa and in Chan tournament to fill up. And I also don't think that, the, that our younger players here from the league uh, don't deserve uh, this, uh, to play or to, to join the national team. But coach, last, in general, last, um, calling in the, the first days of the league wasn't hard for you. Again? Calling uh, uh, players in the first days of the league was not hard for you. Um, okay, you, you, you see players also in the preparation games. Uh, um, uh, my, uh, my assistant coaches are watching matches. One of my assistant coaches is a, a league coach by, by himself. Mm -hmm. So I think I get enough information uh, to make a good judgment about who is uh, coming to the camp and uh, who is maybe coming next time. Mm. Coach, coach. lastly, is it true that you talked with the Benin coach about how to beat Nigeria? Because we read it in Nigeria newspapers. <laughs> <laughs> um, sure, sure. Uh, we are, I, we are, I, I can't say we are friends, but we know each other personally for a long time. Uh, through our work, uh, also development in other countries. And um, uh, we said if it's possible, uh, sh we will help each other. So he will, for example, get uh, information about our match when we play against Syria. Uh, he will give me information because he is playing against Nigeria. Um, uh, unfortunately, now we are playing against a German coach, uh, so okay. two German coaches are working against the other German coach. Uh, it's somehow a funny situation, yeah. um, but okay, I think this is, a, this is normal. Yeah. Uh, and yeah. uh, so it's a win-win it, it's situation for both coaches, and if we are both qualifying, then it's the best what can happen. Last time we saw Jojo uh, Quizera, but it wasn't on the first call-up. Can we expect a surprise like that this time? Quizera? Okay, there, there was another guy invited uh, as a new player, um, but he had to, um, or we, we, he had a call with me and he said uh, his wife is getting twins uh, and the birth is uh, at our first match. Uh, and uh, so, and it, at the moment there are complications, uh, so he doesn't really know. And I said, okay, if, first, if you can't come to the first match, only to come for the second match, and then it's not sure because maybe it's a compli complication and your mind is somewhere else. I said, okay, better you stay at home for, for this camp and uh, we look for the next camp. Who is he? Uh, I, uh, I don't have the name anymore. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to start the uh, uh, Afghan uh, qualifiers. Can you uh, assure Rondan that uh, the objective for this qualifiers is to get a ticket for Afghan? It's almost 20 years. Wonder did they play there? Uh, what, what answer you are expecting? Uh, 
I will tell you what that are you, the boss is not asking uh, you to uh, the boss is always asking uh, win matches. Uh? So and 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 I I am also uh, going to Libya and we want to win the match in Libya. Uh, and uh, uh, if we, as I said, if you win all the matches, you will qualify, and sooner or later you will, will, will be world champion. Huh? Yeah. So uh, the question is, how how big is the chance that uh, it will be like that? And for that, you have to work hard, and that's what we are doing.